Hi guys, so in today's video we are going to visit the Gordon Ramsay burger restaurant at the Planet Hollywood Hotel in Las Vegas and we're going to review it. I was talking to some of you earlier on YouTube in a chat and you were really excited because you're big fans of Gordon. So we are also excited, especially after we had a bit of a patchy ride yesterday visiting the Guy Fieri restaurant. And so now let's go there. We've just come back from the restaurant and we're absolutely full. The food was lovely, it was really nice. First of all, when we arrived, um, we will show you in the footage now, it was a really long line. There was a line earlier in the day when Paul was there and he checked it out beforehand and even when we left it was always a huge long line. The good thing is we are diamond card holders with Caesars and so we were able to skip the line. We got a lovely table, had plenty of space around us and yeah it just felt like a really nice atmosphere and obviously Gordon really took care and had people design it that way. And yeah we ordered as a starter a hummus and the hummus was really nice. The pita bread that came with the hummus um, was perfect, it was just heated up slightly, it wasn't toasted, it was just the way you should have pita bread, so that was really nice. And the vegetables were really fresh. Paul wanted some onion rings, so we also ordered some onion rings and I think that, I think he should have stopped by then, because it was really filling, really nice. And we ordered... Um, he ordered a hock burger with no cheese. A hock is a kind of pork, you can look it up. It looks a bit like a sheep, it has long hair and he loved it. I ordered the Hell's Kitchen Burger. The Hell's Kitchen Burger is normally not vegetarian but I've replaced the patty with a plant-based patty. And the plant-based patty, the waiter right away told me, um, don't worry, it tastes of beef, beef, but it really isn't beef. And it was amazing, it was like magic, it really tasted of beef. It had the texture of a normal burger, really nice, really flavorsome. I really enjoyed that. And you had to order the fries separately as well, so we also ordered some fries. For dessert, Paul had the sticky toffee pudding ice cream sandwich for $9 and I had the white and milk chocolate parfait for $7. I really liked that it had fresh berries in it. The dessert was a bit too heavy for me and also Paul said his dessert was a bit heavy. If you have a starter and the main course, then if you're there with someone else, you might want to share the dessert. As a drink, we ordered a beer flight. It's like a selection of four small glasses of beer. And it was nice, we could choose the beer, you can mix and match whatever beer you want. And yeah, it was really good, it cost $15. Yeah, overall, the service, it was really good. Um, they were attentive, but not annoying. We had plenty of space. It is worth lining up for. But if you're a diamond card holder, remember you can go to the desk and ask to be seated earlier or right away. Other than that, I would say go maybe between lunchtime and the early evening to, so you don't have to wait too long. So anyway, well done Gordon, we can really recommend it.